Hi, Franklin Pillsbury with the Marine Max Dallas Yacht Center. Another beautiful Sea Ray offered up to you. This is a 340 Sundancer. Get them, they don't last long. So let's do a quick walkthrough. If you look at the bow of the boat, this not only has the anchor windlass on the front with the foot pedals, but it also has a capstan on the top of the anchor winch so that if you uh, get hung up or you want to use it, you can use that capstan. You'll also notice as you look at the boat, this thing really glistens and shines, and it's a gorgeous, beautiful boat. Bottom pane is current. Stripes look good on the side. And also note the top. This has not only the forward bimini, but also the aft enclosure. So uh, summertime, you've got the additional shade of the top and the back. Fall, winter, spring boating, you can completely enclose. The lower snaps below the windshield, it has a nice cockpit cover. So this time of year when you keep it in your boat slip, you can keep that cockpit cover on it. As we uh, step to the back of the boat, again, you can see the real pristine condition of this 340. Nice big swim platform back with your uh, three-step ladder that goes down in the water that uh, even guys my age and size can get, up and get in the boat very, very easily. Uh, dunnage box, back here on the back to keep your lines, fenders, obviously easy for your shore power cords to uh, hook in as well. So we step into the cockpit of this 340, you'll notice how big the sitting area is back here. Plenty of room all the way around to set uh, six adults, nice size table whether you're having meals, cocktails, looking out at the sunset or the sunrise in the morning with a cup of coffee. 340 has a wet bar, sink here, additional isotherm refrigerator back here in the cockpit, trash receptacle, and one of the things that I really like, a removable ice chest so that you can both carry ice on board, but for the weekend keep plenty of ice on the boat. Unique on this 340, is we have a companion seat on the port side and then seats here on the starboard side at the helm. This has a uh, updated Lowrance chart recorder uh, GPS. Very, very Also, this boat has 400 hours on it even and uh, everything runs, drives well. It is a V-drive boat, more desirable than the stern drives. Nice clean helm area. Again, our canvas and our top enclosure, we can be uh, fully enclosed here at the hem. Pad here to sit up and uh, drive if you'd like to. Tilt steering wheel. And of course, you can fold the seat down, have your companion sitting here with you, and uh, the extra guest over on the other side. So we walk into the uh, cabin of the 340. talked about this before on the 340s. This boat has as much space in it today as a current 37 foot boat. It's got a nice big wide beam. You've got plenty of room down here. Plenty of head clearance here in the cabin area. Single bunk running the length of the boat here so that you're not in here sideways. This has an upgraded mattress to it. Very, very nice place to spend the boat. Uh, Lockers on either side of the boat. Storage areas here in the salon. Nice big couch and uh, sitting area here in the salon area, as well as the receptacle here for our table. Um, back here in the back, Will was getting a good shot of the entertainment center. And for me, this is one of the best spots on the boat. Got plenty of room back in here, you can set three or four people. You've got the TV here that you can uh, be watching a football game on or golf or if the kids are on board, they can be playing video games and doing that kind of thing. We've talked about this before, but the open stairway makes this whole boat feel so open and so big. The galley, very important area. Uh, not only have the TV here, but a big wide sink. Two burner electric stove microwave, ample storage, our electric refrigerator, 
drawer storage and a nice big catch-all area for cleaning supplies, paper towels, uh, trash receptacle as well. In the head, got plenty of room to stand up here in the head. Our shower curtain. This has, as we've talked about before, the telephone style shower that goes up here. Also has the transom shower, so if you don't want to use this area, you don't have to. Large head area back here in the back with the vacuum flush head. This 340C ray, as all the 340C rays we get in here at the Dallas uh, Yacht Center, won't last very long. This boat is clean, nice, well maintained. Um, I'll challenge you to find any nick scratches or anywhere on the boat. You get down in the bilge area, it's clean, neat, batteries uh, are in good shape. So uh, give me a call, check out this 340 Sea Ray Sundancer here at the Marine Max Dallas Yacht Center. We can get you out on the water and help teach you how to go cruising.